Only play <laughs> with friends. Welcome to Castlevania. Dave is playing because he said he can do it. We're playing on the official uh, NES. Obviously, you can tell by the <laughs> definitely artifacts on the screen. R really? Editor, add artifacts to the screen. <laughs> Yeah, add like motion blur to everything. It'll make it really hard to see and make anything out. Just blur it. No, you can stop that now. Okay. Oh, you f***ing idiot! You what? you missed the trick. Wow, an actual idiot! You literally just lost two it. points. Stop. You're trying to exit out of the game. And uh, you thank you, like Janus. That. That, I want that to be jump. I want these to be whip. You dumb gay sh. <laughs> <laughs> Holy sh no. So, uh, let's all give one fact about Castlevania. Go. The music rocks. That's- that's true. Um, the music does f rock. I love all the music in this game. The music just rocks. It's- I'm sorry. That's the only fact. You don't need it. These if you games are- play Castlevania, play- play for the f music, and just, like, sit in the first level, and the next level, and any other level after. The music has kind of, like, a Five Nights at Freddy's story behind it, do you know that? It does, What yeah. do you mean? Where the woman, like, wrote all this music for, like, funeral homes to play in the background. They were like, this sounds just like a f weird video game about Dracula, so she took that as inspiration and put You're it in You're kidding, that's- that's real? No, you f <laughs> <laughs> That would've been f amazing if it was. That was quite a large spiel. I actually had no idea, I was totally entranced. Why would you believe that? Because it sounds like- yeah, this sounds kind of cool. You believe the part where they said that this belongs in a video game about Dracula? That part sounded kind of weird, but I thought you no, were just, I you know... I thought you were interpreting it your own Chris way. I I'm thought sorry. people just said, like, this is really creepy and should be, like, in, like, a... Uh, what is it? Like, Brother Lugosia? Mm. Movie? All I'm saying is... The woman accidentally wrote it to be good, because women can't do anything right. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks except for that write one, music. Chris. You know, you can actually, like, uh... Uh, no, go back! Go back! Dave, you could damage uh, boost. Can you please stand to the right in the middle of that pillar? Okay, editor, uh, cut out that uh, window and uh, up, make make it upside down and put it underneath the two windows and make a little happy face. And make it say, Toasty! Yeah! <laughs> yes! <laughs> I hate that meme. That's the stupidest shit. I remember that. That used to be in like every Newgrounds cartoon. It's not a meme. It was in a yeah, video, it was, video game. It was also in Stickman on Crack along with the Homer. Go! Oh! Yeah. <laughs> What the hell? I pause time in the game with the stopwatch. Oh, those are some goofy looking fucking fish people. <laughs> I like the way they squat down to scream. <laughs> <laughs> but they, they're like walk animations. They've already like skipped the beat and then before they move a foot again. They're, they're cool. Yeah, this game is fun. When I was a kid, uh, this was the hardest fucking game I ever played in my life and I could only be the first boss. And then I'm like, I give up. <laughs> I remember my friend showing me this, and I was like, what the fuck? This is impossible. This is why nobody likes these dumbass games anymore. <laughs> I now the now same I fucking thing. love these. Yeah, you have an appreciation for these games as time goes on. People really hate the knockback, but I don't mind it too much. The knockback- it, It's part of the challenge. Like, the game's balanced to have that. Yeah, because you hit- you fucking one-shot most things. Except for later levels. Aw, uh, you threw the axe. That's a Smash the, Brothers move. The classic Smash Brothers move. I fucking hate the axe in Smash Brothers, along with like you tossing every other holy water, fucking the axe, and you also whip people from six feet away. Actually, I'm trying to get like a thing real quick. Money? Before, the, before that bat comes down. Oh, That's the boss. This is the boss that like, I could beat him. Oh, you fucked it! Uh, that's what I want! Uh, I could beat him, but I also got my ass kicked every single time. Wow, Dave, you know what you're doing. Whoa! Yeah. Good job. Die, you dumb bat bastard! If we were playing Simon's Quest, you would have had to throw holy water all the way up to that point, and then finally saw if it was an actual boss. That- that part's fucking annoying. It's That's crazy. That's every single fucking dungeon! Or dungeon, whatever. It's funny, because, like, the books kind of, like, allude to that, but it's still, like, way too cryptic. That's dumb, though. It's like, they should have just made a little block that, like, phased in and out when you had to throw holy water on it, you know? Like, little bit- little- little, little, little bit of NES tricks. I don't think these knights can be one shot. You actually need to, like, hit them more than once. So what is it? If you hit- if you hit an object with your, uh, item that you have, yeah. like, ten times, I think it is, a number two will drop down, and then you'll get- that'll upgrade the strength of that item. I never even- I don't even know what you're talking about. You'll see. Yeah, yeah. Dave, fuck you. You oh, need to fuck. collect human hearts. Okay, get on that. What are human hearts doing this again? Are they your, like, they, power gauge? They're the, uh, Currency? ammo for the item. Oh. Yeah, oh there's the number two. So there we go. something weird. 
So now our item, like the cross, is stronger now that we got the number two. Like dirty turkey sandwiches that are stuck in walls or <laughs> things you eat. That is not something that happens at IRL. Yeah, you can't eat. Yeah. I want to make an yeah. observation. Try that doesn't really happen usually. Wow, that's quite an observation. <laughs> yeah, I have an idea for a cartoon. Just hear me out. Okay. So. Uh, Castlevania Simon goes into a room, he's like, Oh, Fuck. boy, I'm parched. And he smashes a hole in the wall, pulls out a turkey, he's the like, fucks mm -hmm. it. And he eats it, and he goes, that's tummy egg, and he's like, Oh, I got diarrhea! I've got the shits. Dude. He looks in the camera and says, I've got the shits and, over and, and over and over. And then it cuts to him in the bathroom with really loud, realistic diarrhea sounds. <laughs> when it's, and it says the end. <laughs> no. He puts toilet paper on the end of his whip, starts whipping his asshole with it. <laughs> Okay, you just made it better. <laughs> fucking get right there! Win, win style, that's what that is. Oh, now I have the fucking small whip too. Life sucks. That was my Simon cartoon. And then Medusa's coming. Medusa's, Medusa's coming and start making out with him. After the credits, of course. Actually, I would probably do that. That almost feels like a sick, a sick animation cartoon where he starts like quietly making out with Medusa's after <laughs> taking a realistic shit. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> no offense to Mark M. Mark M? Mark him. Mark him. Mark and Polo. Watch out, Dave. These Medusas. Angry video game gardener told me told, told me they suck. Yeah, he grinned here. He was pissed. This part was really pissy. He did piss. Oh my god. He said, "Ass," and he fell off the cliff. Oh, you big fat idiot! You're hemorrhaging health, dickweed. We have dick safe. We have I'm not even hemorrhaging. It. I'm falling off fucking platforms. Yeah. You smegma inhaling. <laughs> Get to the left. <laughs> oh wait, you're not dying. You just keep falling to your death. Uh, yeah, you got it. Wait, are you dying or are you not dying? Oh, I'm dying. Okay, well, dumb fucking pussy nozzle. You Dave. need to fucking actually... Yeah. A burn animal lets itself into your room while you're sleeping. Defecate. It dances seductively at the foot of your bed. What kind of barn animal? Excuse Any me. Any barn animal. What's a barn animal? <laughs> like a horse? Like a horse or, or a piggy or a dog? That doesn't make any sense, bro. Chris, you're kind of talking like fucking nonsense right Chris, now. Chris, how can a pig open up a door? He uses his curly tail and turns the handle, stupid. I didn't find a video of a pig opening door and prove me wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he uses his fucking tail. <laughs> prove me wrong. <laughs> I didn't find a video of a pig spraying shit all over the barn. <laughs> Blur it out, of course. <laughs> Better find a video of a dog running headfirst into oncoming traffic. <laughs> <laughs> or into a door, whichever is more better suited. Or find a video of a dog licking the top of a baby's head. And I've the baby's seen that. eyes are open, all scared. I've seen that. It makes me laugh. I know exactly <laughs> what you're talking about. I think that's a picture online. Might not be a video. No, it's a video. It's like a dog is like holding the baby with his little paws and he's like licking and the baby's just balling. Have you his seen the full out. video of that though? Where the dog licks it like 400,000 times and the- the 400,000 yeah, times. Yeah, and the top of the head starts turning like slowly red. Yeah, it's, it's one of those 10-hour videos. Yeah. And the baby's eyes start rolling into the back of his head. Due to erosion? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, dogs acidic fucking tongues. Wait, I wonder if this pauses them. Oh yeah, it does. O M to G Zords. Okay. Yeah, you're kind of a dork. Aw, oh, Dave is a dork, Swords. What a cute dork. You're a dork. Here's something, Dave, that you probably don't know. Days. But <laughs> in uh, Binding of Isaac, there is actually an item called a stopwatch in the game, and it looks just like that. What are the odds? Yeah. Coincidence? Hmm? I think not. Edmund McRipoffer? <laughs> just kidding. Please don't hurt me. No, I mean, like, he knows. It's... The fucking Binding of Isaac is the total Zelda ripoff. Binding of Isaac ripped off every fucking game I've ever played. Yeah, it has Pokemon Go, it has Zelda, Mario, um, it has everything. It even has Fez references. And Simon's Quest. And Final Fantasy VII. And Final Fantasy does VII? It? How? Actually, uh, Cuphead has the Final Fantasy VII intro. Wait, what? it does? Yeah, the main menu is the Final Fantasy VII intro, but with a cup instead of a buster sword. Are you serious? Yeah. What? Yeah. What? <laughs> That's He's true. Lying. That's one hundred percent fact. Patented Chris O'Neill lie. You, <laughs> patented. you sir, <laughs> you sir, I'm not lying. How do you patent a lie? <laughs> <laughs> he patented the lie. Oh no, we're at the boss. I have oh, a shitty weapon. Oh man, green screen out the red and make it fucking bright green. Yeah. Uh, uh, and then put might, a video footage behind it. Then green screen out the green and put in Lord of the Rings, Helm's Deep. Oh god, why did you get the fucking stopwatch? All right, oh you, yeah, you, this is easy. You die, you, you just fucking do this, idiot. You... Wait, dude, the, the stopwatch is so overpowered yes, in this yes, game. Yes, yes, yes. Woo! 
And you were like, oh no, I have the worst <laughs> weapon. And you literally didn't even let it hit you once. <laughs> yeah, Dave. That's called winning. Are you uh, trolling? I, I remember what do you normally use? Okay. The axe overhead? Okay, wait, wait. In three, I think the stopwatch doesn't really work on bosses. So that's what I'm thinking of. Because three has like scarred me with how hard it is. Three is fun. Three is really fun. Oh, this is the best be song. I love this song. Three is the best in the series, but it is goddamn hard. It rocks. I love the the changing team thing. It was very cool. It also has some of the best fucking music. Yeah, this music rocks. <laughs> oh, you can make these guys Hello, disappear, Mom. Dave. What? How? Just inch in, and then no, no, you ruined it. You got to inch in slowly, and then you move out of the screen. You do the old screen. <laughs> oh, there you go. You okay, inch in slowly. Inch in slowly. Uh, stop. Oh, okay. uh, that didn't go right. Yes, now he's dead. Oh, he came back. Never this, mind. Uh, this might be because it's not a new collection. It all, yeah, it might not. Uh, it, it doesn't have the NES oh, flare. Yeah. <laughs> he jumped off. Dude, that skeleton. That skeleton is crazy. He was going. <laughs> <laughs> Does you throw holy water in front Dude, of you? Dude, put and it the creates fucking like mouse a... from mouse hunt in all those holes. <laughs> then play the mouse hunt theme. What is the mouse? Or hunt? don't. Mouse hunt theme. <laughs> oh, you're... Yeah, put a realistic field mouse in all those shots. There has to be a realistic field. Yeah, in every fucking mouse hole, put that fucking mouse. Yeah, I, editor? Come on. You don't have to track the camera, though. Just have him, like, awkwardly sliding all over. Wow, fuck, what, fuck, what a fuck, great fuck, item. Fuck, fuck! Oh, oh you know, you could've just slashed it. Dude, blue screen at the Where's blue and put in the entire oh, mouse no! hole movie. <laughs> Dave. No, you can stop. I'm sorry, editor. Please. I'm just trying to entertain. That's all. Entertain million. Editor, make all of the graphics photorealistic. <laughs> you can just write no on the screen whenever you want to deny me. <laughs> You're like, editor, editor, do this, editor, do that, editor, do this, editor, do that. Editor, delete system 48. If you delete system 33, your computer builds itself even taller. Yeah, everyone always gets fooled with the first step of deleting 32. <laughs> but if you just delete 33, you fix everything. <laughs> Dumbass. The one time in my life my computer crashed and I lost everything on the hard drive, I had a cartoon I made that was about two stick figures playing Guitar Hero and they live together. And it was the worst cartoon I ever made in my life. Yeah. And, and I was going to release it that week and then my hard drive failed horribly and I couldn't recover it. But I'm, I'm so thankful that it got deleted. Because it would have been the worst thing I ever put online. It would have embarrassed me to this day. <laughs> really? It was just these two fucking loser stick men who, who thought they were really good. Like, I thought it was the coolest, funniest shit ever. It was just them playing Guitar Hero and being really good at it. What if it was your best video you ever? Dick. And it, it, it still, definitely was uh, not. What if it garnered more attention than, uh, Hoopa Hut Gangnam Style? I'm sure it would have gotten, like, 200,000 views in Daily Second on Newgrounds What if it got shit? 200 million views and it was, like, the most viewed video all the time? And it was always cited as your best creation. Okay, that would have been cool. But it wouldn't have happened. Yeah, well, I mean, you don't Chris, know. You don't it never know. Came out. Yeah, it got wiped off the face of the I earth. I didn't even have a name for it. Uh, uh, Stickman playing Guitar Hero. Epic walls. Guitar, <laughs> guitar Hero Bros. <laughs> Fuck yes. Walls and Sue. Real. Oh, you fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> walls and Sue. I used to love that. Hilarity ensues. It was in the, like every Newgrounds description. Yeah. That is a good one, honestly. I'm still not sick of that to this day. Like, stupid <laughs> one and ugly <laughs> two go into the city. Hilarity ensues. <laughs> I, I don't think I've used hilarity ensues in one of my things before. Everyone should put that in every fucking description for the rest of the time. I used to, when I made videos, we had this, like, meme with our group, which is kind of gay to think, but with, like, bum tumblers, we had, uh, parentheses laugh. Because it was, like, a reference to, like, an anime. <laughs> Because, like, anytime he laughed, it said parentheses laugh. Oh, and he funny. actually said parentheses laugh. Did he really? Yeah, which made it even funnier. <laughs> so we used to just say parentheses laugh all the time, which was just like, to someone else, we just seemed like lunatics, but. That's funny. It was like a funny reference at the time. Now, oh, oh my dude. god, you just. You got absolutely drive by butt fuck right there. Did you I, see I that? Dude, I remember this next boss being Lucky. really fucking hard. You should pick that oh, up okay. so you can just freeze time. Actually, yeah, you should. <laughs> that was a waste. Can you, can you use that over and over? As long as I have the hearts to do it. Huh. Oh, freestyle! Oh. <laughs> oh man, this would have been hard. Damn. Oh, freestyle! Uh oh. Damn, We're almost out of hearts. I know, you dumbass. Where's your ugly fucking hearts at? There you go. Where's There's your fucking one. hearts now? And yeah, now I'm fucked. <laughs> <laughs> I hated this fucking boss. At least you got you a big bag of is? money. I think it's Frankenstein, right? It might- it might be, uh... Dave, at least you got Maybe your big I'm bag wrong. of money. At the very, I think there's a chicken right up above my head here. 
Let's see. Nope. Well, there's a heart. With your yeah. name on it. Don't fucking freeze time anymore. Look for the secret rock. To jump up there. Oh. Oh, that's not oh. fucking wow. fair. What the fuck? What a complete asshole. Freeze! Oh! I'm out of hearts. Oh. oh my god. At least you're here. Alright, whip I upgrade. hate those freaking crows. You need to devise a better strategy. Yeah, maybe, maybe... That's not fair! Maybe this fucking tar That's dazzle. Castlevania. Those things suck. Maybe this idiot should learn how to whip in all directions. Yeah, what a twat. Yeah, what a dumbass. Nice. Davy, 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 you like to eat my gravy? <laughs> you like it? Oh, what you can destroy Davey? bullets. I hate those thing, man. The crows. Oh, you that, bitch! That really worked <laughs> for me. <laughs> that really yeah, worked. Nice try. Maybe so eat my gravy. <laughs> right here. Wait, wait, Thanks wait, for those wait, lyrics, Bruno Floss. Bruno Floss would be like, I am Simon and I'm on a quest and I'm going in right now. Medusa heads flying by oh, and fucked. snake head shooting oh, me. Fucked. The oh, you fucked. No, I got this. That's him. That's the guy I hate. That guy's a piece of shit. Breaking schnitzel. Have fun, dude. Oh yeah, it was two of them. Forgot. Lucky. <laughs> but you know what? We shouldn't just sing the whole time. It might get really old. But it's hard not it to. It is fucking hard not to. Certain games have that effect, don't they? Yeah. Well, the, all the music in this game is like that. This game sucks. <laughs> the music's <laughs> shit. The graphics are dumb. That is a Brental Floss original. <laughs> That's what he would do. <laughs> this Medusa's game is tough. This game is hard. Is hard. <laughs> <laughs> Too damn hard. Oh, the hell? <laughs> That's not funny. Yes, it is. I just rhymed. I just had to do it. I'm it sorry. It works. It works. You got the <laughs> rhyme <laughs> bug. That's what Breno Floss would have wanted, anyways. He probably would have said that. Yeah, Breno Floss would have loved it if you called him a <laughs> in front of 58,000 people. <laughs> uh, no, I don't mean it. Put Dave in as the background. Just an up close shot of his head. <laughs> We have footage now, so... Increase saturation by 400%. <laughs> Increase contrast by 2800%. Good job, Edder. Edder, you're really kicking ass. <laughs> you don't even really need to fight them, you just go. The exit is just beyond them. No, you, you, you have to fight them. No, I know, I'm just joking. <laughs> Why'd you think you just jump through them? Isn't that cool how you can get hit and just get, like, tank damage as you're already flying through the air? Actually, that's pretty cool. Dude, you need to swap up your little... Dave. Your little yeah, I've, I've got to restart the level. Dave, really? Dave. Yeah, so I can get a better item, yeah. Dave. Jump. Can you go back on those stairs and stand on the first ledge and just, like, hit them from up there? Like, duck hit them? Nah, you have to go in there to, like, engage the fight. Alright, well, you okay, need like, to... I'll, I'll level up the water this time, then we'll have them in our, like, little hands. Yeah. Personally, I believe you can do it if you just stick to it. You Thanks, know? Chris. That's kind of the mantra of these games, honestly. Just man, do it man, again man, and again. Man. You stop it. Stop! Stop! You cut it out! Stop burning me! <laughs> well, I don't know why he would throw his bones. Eventually, he's just gonna fall into a pile of fucking bone mush. <laughs> what an idiot. That's the Castlevania parody. Hey, wouldn't you run out of bones after a certain period? The skeleton goes, says, oh, yeah. Wait up, my god, he falls apart. <laughs> and then the fucking fat ass at his computer starts clapping his feet together and pissing all over himself. Yeah, uh, cue the clip from, uh, uh, How to Be a YouTube Celebrity. He was like, ah! <laughs> That's he's so like, annoying. Laughing. I hate that fucking video. That was the Go Anime one, where he's like, oh, ah! That sucks. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> I made that video in one day. You're like, well, it was because Harry you. made one. I, I know. fucking ripped him off. Harry's was pretty good. Dang it, man. Fuck. Yours was also good, Chris. Thanks, Corey. It made me. You long. know what? I actually, I don't even know why I ragged on Go Anime because I love all the Go Anime cringe on YouTube. It's just because like the internet or like YouTube has this like hard on for Caillou getting grounded. <laughs> I 
It's really like almost like disturbing. Like some of them just end with him being grounded and crying. And it's like, what is your problem? <laughs> like I watched one today of this girl who's like, <sighs> she's like, dad, I want to play on the phone. And he's like, oh, don't you know, girl, you're grounded. And then she just cries. And then the brother's like, am I grounded? He's like, no, because you're boy. Girl is grounded. And then the girl went to her room and cried. There's, and then it ended. there's some kind of this weird phenomenon with that shit. Like little I, kids just yeah. relate to it super hard, I guess. I, I don't know what it is, but there's just there's just fucking like out for blood for Caillou. They fucking hate everything Caillou's ever done. And Caillou he's just, is fucking annoying to look at, you have to admit. He is annoying, but he's just this little five-year-old who, like, I guess they want to see him get beat within an inch of his life, because there's so many Caillou videos of Caillou beaten to death. Like, those are popular search terms on YouTube. And it's I'm like, like most relax. Of those. Yeah. Like, I watched a Caillou video today where someone put, like, actual audio of people getting Corey, beaten up so with Caillou So far you said you watched eye. two Caillou videos today. Yes! You are the prime demographic for these videos. No, I'm not! <laughs> I'm just looking for gold, okay, in these parts. I just type in Caillou and search by last hour, and I get, like, the best Caillou gold you could ever ask for. Okay, you're What if right. I was looking for Caillou episode 3, when he had to get his- go to the dentist, and instead I got Caillou gets burned on a grill? Hot, 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 hot. Everyone always tries lying and saying Caillou has cancer. He doesn't? That's no, funny. he's just a burn victim. Yeah, he got the horribly burned. It's funny, they all hate his parents, too. Cause like, in the Caillou Gets Grounded videos, they're always like, Brut I'm Caillou's dumb, shitty dad, Brutus. And you're grounded, Caillou. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, Brutus. Like the gorilla? Or Boris, his name is Boris. Brutus the gorilla. No, his name's Boris. Okay. His name's Boris. I don't know what the mom's name is. Lafonda, yeah, I, I think? His mom's name is Wakanda? Lafonda. <laughs> Wakanda. <laughs> Lafonda. Lashankwa. That's the name of that one chick from, uh, Laquifa. Laquifa is his mom's name. <laughs> Hello, I'm Laquifa. Shanaquifa. Queen Latifah? <laughs> <laughs> That's Caillou's mom. Uh, Borish and Queen Latifah are fucking... <laughs> <laughs> it's a Caillou was born from. Oh man, you're getting fucking medusa so hard. <laughs> go on, then. Go on, then. This, go on, this then. actually should go pretty well, though. <gasps> uh... You're dead. You're fucking dead. Oh nah, my god. Oh my god. That, that was sick. That kinda pretty good. Hey. Woo. Good job. Combs your hair and makes you look too. presentable. <laughs> uh, the power of stage three items up there. <laughs> good job, Dave. Yeah. Uh, Old game in the system. Use his uh. eyedropper to place mercury drop in the corner of your eye. Why? Don't. <laughs> That is a cartoon sound. Boop. Have have him break his legs. Haha, <laughs> joke cartoon. <laughs> joke cartoon. I'm gonna make Castlevania cartoon. He's gonna fall down and break his legs. He's like, dang it, fuck. Dude, me and Zach went to some bar lately, and fucking uh, the waiter guy. He, he was watching Zach draw pictures in Zach's sketchbook. Mm -hmm. He's like, that is so funny. Have you guys ever seen Joe Cartoon? <laughs> that shit's classic. We were like, sounds like Tommy Wiseau. I know. We were like, listen, you fucking egghead. <laughs> if you say that one more time, and then wow, we like, we, we aimed the pen right into his eyeball, and we were about to push it into his skull, but then the fucking manager took away the pen. Chris, it looks like the the California life is really taking a toll on him. <laughs> it's turned me into a fucking bastard. Turned you into a monster. Uh, you just have to be like that to and then, survive, then, man. And then Zach's just like pulled out his pen. He's like, "Who do I make this out to?" <laughs> if you know who Zach is, like, that looked like a platform. Oh god, damn it! Like Joe Cartoon is the last thing Zach would ever talk about. Joe Cartoon is so like, like, old. What the fuck? That's it, like it's super pretty much fly. just like like hamster in a microwave. Yeah, I was just like, yeah, hamster Donald in a blender. Trump in a microwave. They had Justin Bieber, Bieber in a blender. Yeah, they have like Donald Trump in a blender. It sucks. It's fucking epic, actually. Now, the more I think about it, the more I want to watch it's it. It's just like crappy old internet. Actually, it feels more like old hit cartoons that... It's like Jeff's, like, ancient old style before he learned how to draw people with... That's what Jeff used to draw like? He used, yeah, he used to draw people with, like, baseball heads. I've seen Jeff's, like... Like, fine art stuff from college, and he was fucking insane. He could yeah. draw, like, amazing portraits and stuff. Yeah, he was really talented. Um, but, uh... 
Character art of people doesn't really sell, especially if you don't live on a boardwalk, so uh, you can't really <laughs> pursue that as a career. That's a good point. That, yeah, that's, that's the best I've ever heard it said. I mean, it's true. It's like, where Fucking else you... God damn. Are you gonna... <laughs> have you ever seen, like, a business where people draw, like, cartoony versions of you? It's just, like, a store on, like, the end of a street? It's like, that would never... That business wouldn't stay in It is kind of messed up forever. that, like, the better at art you are, the less likely people are to care. Yeah. Like, like, if you can draw something perfectly photorealistically, it's like, no one really gives a shit. Yeah, it's like, They, they want to see something, like, in, in a weird style. Yeah, it's always funny when you see people who are, like, cartoonists, and they kind of just, like, do, like, very basic cartoon things. I don't know, like, Jeff really understands, like, he understands, like, the, the Mad TV style Bastard. of cartooning, where you accentuate the parts of the character like if they have like yeah. really squinty eyes you squint their eyes but some people just like when they're doing like characters they draw them all the exact same yeah yeah with like these like hollywood smiles and it's like not i still am really bad smile, at but a good try I, I really can't do that shit. i can't do it either i'm not you know i'm not saying i can do it it's fucking hard to me jeff is like the master of that and yeah, Rodrigo's jeff is really, really good, good at, at that, that too yeah rod's good uh bows is also good and honestly flash kids are pretty good at it too. yeah that's true you give credit where credit is due. I can't draw a real person to save my fucking life. All my shit just looks like cartoony chicken scratch. Chicken I fucking scratch. suck. Your and stuff is very good, for Oh, uh, you made it to the woods. Oh, nice. You're really high up. You know what this? You know what this level looks Whoa. like? This looks like a level that would be in Ninja Gaiden. Fuck, night. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I hate those little fuckers. The imps are fucking horrible. Uh oh. Dave! Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you, but you, you keep throwing the hot water bottle at him, it's not working. Dude, I love hot water bottles. I've never- what? what do you, yeah, what do you mean hot water bottle? You know, it's really weird that Tommy Wiseau, like, drink hot water. That's really, like, weird. You think Tommy Wiseau is weird? Just the fact that he would go to a restaurant, he'd be like, yeah, I want hot Gosh. water. And they're like, hot? He's like, yeah, what, are you dumb? Hot <laughs> water. I got the, uh, the Disaster Artist <laughs> audiobook, which yeah. is like 16 hours <laughs> long, and it's really good. Yeah, doesn't Greg, like, read Yeah, he, he, he voices Tommy Wiseau, and it's just like, how he voices him. He's like, huh, what are you, slow of hearing? Hot water, <laughs> get on it. He makes him sound like such an asshole. He is kind of an asshole. He is, though, that's the thing. It's like, kind of endearing how close to the character he kept it. He yeah. wasn't even, like, trying to... Like special shade it. Whoa! Whoa! Good oh. job. Good job. <laughs> you thought he could trick. I me. love tricks like that. This is like that. some Mega Man shit right here. Yeah, with the door loading in. Ooh. Dude, put the mouse on mouse there. What is it? You in yeah, the fucking mouse? Yeah, put another mouse. mouse put another fucking mouse went by. Oh fuck! Like a big mouse from body. You. Oh no. Dang it, Dave. Oh uh, my fucking Christ, Dave. They yeah. sent you so far back, dude. I bet you collect hard. Yeah, you yeah. feel like a fucking joke right now. Yeah, you feel like a joke cartoons. <laughs> Just to bring it back. <laughs> right, David we're, we're gonna get the stopwatch and we're not gonna get rid of it. Alright, if we're talking about old cartoons, I didn't see joke cartoons. The first kind of cartoons I saw, and I think we talked about this, was stickdeath.com with like the beast or whatever. I remember just like, I made a fucking skeleton. beast cartoon as a kid. I love that shit. And then there was just like the guy with like anger management where he was like playing ping pong and his friend was pissing him off. So he yeah. put the ping pong paddle into the thing and shot it off his head. That shit's so fucking lame looking back at it, but I love that as a kid. As a kid, you love stickman deaths. Yeah. There was nothing I love more than stickman on crack as a kid. <laughs> yeah. When you hear that Homer Simpson dough, you're just like, this? I relate to this so hard. <laughs> and the giant cheeseburger falls on the stickman. He's like, dun, dun. he's like, dun, 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 there was a weird you know. there was a weird period on Newgrounds where every cartoon stole jokes from The Simpsons. Yeah. Like verbatim. And everyone was just like, that's really funny. And but no they one used called this, it out. They used the same fucking like 240p sound sound font that was ripped years ago. I'm not even talking about the dough. I'm talking about literal like 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 good jokes from The Simpsons that everyone knows are from The Simpsons. And there was a weird period where everybody was talking about the fucking cooked hams or whatever. That that became something. Yeah, like in recent years. Yeah. I, I really hate when like classic Simpsons bits just become memes for no reason. Yeah, Ooh. I mean, don't get me wrong. Them. The cooked ham thing was funny, but I don't think it was worth. It's funny because it's it, funny in the yeah. episode. You're doing pretty good, Dave. Yeah, honestly, you didn't even need a fucking extra weapon. You just whip them. Just keep on moving. Don't stop, because there's no reason to stop. You, you have to stand still when you whip them, so you don't pick up the. Well, yeah, 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 that's fair. You don't want to. You want to walk and whip. I don't even think you can walk and whip. Ah. Oh shit! <laughs> Good job. I love that. 
All right, and now the game is gonna try and be really gay and try and give me a knife right here to make me erase the fucking clock. <laughs> yeah, I oh, fucking see what you're doing there. Get out of here, you fucking loser. Oh, at least it disappears. Imagine if it stood there. All Watch right, out. get fucked, fuck you idiot. Watch clock out. power. Oh, it gives you over $50,000. Wow. <laughs> you what better was, live to send it. What the fuck's gonna do with that? You can buy a new car. Buy a slave. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? Simon Belmont. Gonna start a let's play. Yeah, he's like someone blow my ear. Make YouTube videos. And then he puts his camera up to the screen to record himself playing Simon Belmont. <laughs> Watch out, man. Wait, no, it's Simon's Adventure. What I the hated hell is it this. Called? This was the one that pissed me off and made me quit. Uh, I'm sorry. You should be frozen in time. That is what the fucking special power does. Oh, Dave, you need to fucking watch out for those projectiles. I like the noise he makes. Oh! No! The fucking <laughs> orb came down. Honestly, when it comes to this game, the best thing you can do is just hope to god your knockback doesn't fuck you over. Like, if you get hit by both of them, your knockback is gonna fuck you. Yeah, hey, that was also it. bullshit, just you couldn't it. jump up there. Alright, I went. That's yeah, fucking you won. annoying. You, you tanked it, and you won. That's, that's all you really needed to do in life. I'm the best at Castlevania games. Wow. Oh, they got the Mario cool. World orb. Huh? It's like the Mario World Orb, in that level that takes- that opens up to the last Bowser area. Oh yeah. In the sunken ship, remember that? Where you like, fall down and there's all those like, yellow things that... ...go to the side and you fall into the water and grab oh, the green yeah. orb. That was very strange! Why wasn't there another level that did that? Did you ever see that they had like, this thing that was a floating around on the internet, where... When I was a kid, I was like, can you go to that little island up there? And I always thought you could. And then like, this thing was going around on the internet with like, the Mario laser thing. Uh. Where you could actually go to the island and there was like, a special power-up that gave Mario like, a laser gun. Uh. And I was like, there's no fucking way this can be real. Um, and it wasn't, obviously, because why the fuck would Mario have a laser gun with that much detail in a Mario world? But it would be cool if it was. It makes me wonder like... Nintendo, of, of all people, if they added something like that later on, like, if they re-released the world and put that in, that would be fucking awesome. Mm -hmm. Just, like, totally just, like, the secret that only people who, like, knew about the the old, like, thing. Because, I mean, that's, like, you remember, like, uh, with Mortal Kombat, with, like, um... What's his fucking name? Uh... Ermac. Like, Air Macro. Like, people were like, Air Macro's a character, and then they ended up adding him, because, like, people wanted it so bad. Really? Yeah. Hmm. It just it's just cool when game companies add stuff that people clam after. I hope you they add you to Mario as a character. It was like a uh, Scarlet was added. She was just like a recolor of a uh... what the fuck's her name? Wait the a minute. with a body with a nice teeth and a. Corey, you're 30 years old. Yeah. And you like video games? That's a, yeah. I mean, I do. That's Not, kind I don't really of like video games. But I don't okay. really like video games anymore. I just like old games that um... I played once in a while. You like old video games? <laughs> yeah, I like old video games. Kind of cringe. I mean, I'm playing right now, so... You know, I didn't nice. want to rag all, all over you, Cory. But honestly, I don't think I have anything in common with you anymore. <laughs> video games is the only thing holding our relationship together. <laughs> honestly, that's me and that's you. <laughs> We're, be apart. We're shackled together by video games. <laughs> Corey? Yes? If you had skin like a lizard, would you be more racist? What? Probably. If I had skin like a lizard, I would go up on stage in like a presidential campaign and just like take the mic and just scare everybody. That's cool. Be a reptilian. Yeah, I'd be a reptilian for all to see. That would be kind of sick. It would! That's what I'm saying! Like, I would, I would go up where everyone would see me and see me as a reptilian. And I'd be like, I come in peace. <laughs> <laughs> I am good. <laughs> I promise to never betray any of you. I mean, I also, I'd probably be like, please don't laugh. I have leprosy. It's, it is a condition. <laughs> so you'd lie. <laughs> <laughs> please don't laugh. I'm but a simple lizard folk. <laughs> I'm like you. I'm not so different, you and I. I'm not so different. Nobody care me. Look out for a pink skeleton. He's the worst kind of skeleton. Pinko. He was dipped in blood. I like how he just dies but comes back. You fucking yeah, asshole. Like the dry bones. Go down to that kitchen. <laughs> Looks like there's a coffee oh, maker down on there. The other side of there. Watch out. <laughs> Look, it's like coffee. Those are oh. coffee pots. 
I don't, I don't know what kind of coffee you're making. Uh, but, oh, you died! Oh, you died! I did not fucking see that. You fucking dipshit! Um, watch out for that. Nothing. Watch out for it. <laughs> watch out for that nothing. Yeah, good call. Um, that's the that's the biggest baddest thing in the never ending Dang. story. So, you know, Chris, I really wanted movie. to play a Sonic game, but I haven't yet. Corey, let's play Sonic Utopia. It's too late now. Fine. Yeah, <laughs> I just yeah, be like that. <laughs> no, I do at some point. Ooh, that almost touched me. What was I gonna say? I like I like seeing how people play Sonic. I suck at Sonic, especially 2D Sonic games. That's okay, it's not really a game you can just pick up and play. It's honestly a game about trial and error. It's honestly... You're just fighting, like, the clunky momentum. Yeah, pretty much. Once you understand how to abuse the momentum, you can pretty much make the game your bitch. It is just completely trial and error. Like... It is. Running through a 2D Sonic game is just, like, it's just gonna kill you. Pretty much. Basically what Sonic is, like, it's incredibly oh. satisfying to run through a Sonic game after you've beaten it and you understand it. But you're you're basically gonna be bumping around like a dumbass and getting hurt, constantly losing your rings until you master the level and the layout. And then that's when you're like, Hey guys, I can beat Sonic too. And then your friends come over and you can show how fucking cool you are. That's my least like favorite- I figured like, so le my least favorite thing about 2D Sonic is the camera. It's that it has you focused, centered, mm -hmm. you're completely centered in the screen, so... You know you're running I mean? to the right, you can't see anything coming at you if you're You know you're going why there's fast. a problem with that? Those. It's because of how fucking close it is, too. Yeah, that too. When so. the game's, like, been re-released as, like, HD and, like, expanded the screen so you can see more of the left and more of the right, it makes it so much better. Yeah. You can see stuff coming in, and it just makes it more- I understand, like, when I played Sonic 2 on the Genesis, I pretty much just loved the speed it was giving me, and the music was amazing, and everything, it was just like a fucking sensory overload. But, it's also like zoomed fucking close as shit, and it's it's not the best to play. You play like the the ones that's been remade by Christian, Christian Whitehead, <laughs> and it's like, much better. Yeah. Same with Sonic 1. I did, I, I don't know, I've- I don't I've, like Sonic 1 I've at all, I started Sonic 1 multiple times and never finished it, but I did like the Sonic Advance game. Sonic 1 is boring, I'm sorry. I hate to say it, but Sonic 1 is honestly I always get to the part where you have to balance on platforms or you fall into the lava and then I stop. Yeah, playing. Marble, Marble Zone, it's fucking- God, dude. I love the music there, though. But, uh... <laughs> I mean, like, Sonic 1, like, the Green Hills is fun. It's a good opening stage, it's, like, iconic with its setup, but the then, music's like... music's so good. It, it just gets kind of mon monotonous, because you go from, like, Sonic 1, which is, like, you're flying through Green Hills, then you go to Marble Zone, and you kind of meander over lava platforms, and, like... Yeah, it's, uh, like, the worst second level ever. <laughs> yeah, and then the next level is... God, what is it? Is it... I don't... It's, like, the casino place, I believe, right? Nah, uh, I don't I, like that one either. But then it's like the water one, which is the worst one. Labyrinth Zone. Every, every level- <laughs> But then- then it's Starlight, and Starlight fucking rocks. I yeah, love most, Starlight Most zone. of the levels just suck to play through. And then it's the egg- egg zone, and it sucks. Yeah. Sonic 2 is just good. From start to finish, almost every level in Sonic 2 is just like- I've never played it. Dude, it moves. It moves. Like, the pacing? You can beat Sonic 2 in less than an hour. You could beat it in like 45 really? to an hour, yeah. It's easy. I mean, a Sonic game, if you don't stop to look at it, look at all the fucking sprite work, you can beat it pretty quickly. In Sonic, you're not meant to just look at shit. You're supposed to run and let the zone, like, kind of just breeze by you. And the way they designed Sonic 2 was they designed it to keep the momentum going, to keep the motion moving forward. I will say, though, that, uh... I tried playing Sonic Mania and I couldn't get into it either. I don't blame you. The thing about- I still really want to play that. I, I, I really like yet. Mania, but it's because of my bias towards Sonic games. Uh, obviously. Uh, so I enjoyed Mania way more than the average person. But Mania is just like, honestly, some of those stages are like seven minutes long. I just, just I, playing through I didn't it. see any like real innovation or anything. Like no. the, the, the graphics were nice. You can say what it actually is, Chris. It's just like a glorified mod. Yeah. <laughs> That's what it is. But, I mean, I appreciate the effort. Yeah, I, just, I mean, I'm I, a... I, it's not for me. Have you played Castlevania 4? Uh, yeah. I like that one. I like how you Actually, can, like, whip boring. on all directions. Are you I like serious? The, I just like the music and the art. Honestly, yeah, the, the gameplay itself is just whatever. Actually, no. Alright, we, we might kind of get butts Four was here. okay, but fucking Rondo of Blood? Rondo of Blood is Rondo fucking of Blood amazing. Fucking Rock. Really? Yes, it is. I thought you were about extremely to say that good. something different. No, uh, the Sega one or the one that they released on Super Nintendo can suck my fucking asshole. Dr Whoa, Dracula X. Nice. 
Dracula X sucks so fucking bad. Dave, that was really, really good. Yeah, good job. Do you remember- uh, Damn it. Do you remember that? They were like, guys, play where the fucking- where Richter came from. Dracula X! Yeah, and we're like, no, yeah, no. when Nintendo told everybody to play Dracula X, because that's the one they had. Fuck you, dumb assholes. <laughs> Fuck you. you can play Rondo of Blood in this collection pack, or you can get like that weird 3D one for PS. Oh, dude, we should play Rondo. I fucking love Rondo. That has some of the best music in any video game fucking ever. Is yeah. it the same lady who did it? I don't I have no fucking clue. It might be. She was at a Magfest we were at one time. Castlevania has like one of the best soundtracks, I would say. Like every game is just like fucking amazing, except for like maybe. Uh, Lord of Shadows. I really like Short Lord of Shadows. I tried playing that back in the day and I hated it. It's music, just it, it's kind of just more atmospheric. This hallway is really hard. I also, forgot that this came this soon. Lord of Shadows was weird. It, I can't Whoa. even. I can't really explain it. To me, the game felt really claustrophobic, and then they like put you in rooms where you just battle enemies. And you just like it pretty much comes to a point where you feel like you're just fighting enemies more so than playing the game. Oh. God damn, this is hard. Holy shit. Oh. That was really good, Dave. You're doing the old throw the cross, do the hit, yeah, this, jump this, hit. This is the hardest part of the game, hands down. Yeah, this is, um... Th this and the Dracula fight at the end are tough. Death is infamously difficult. I like the sound it was making. He was screaming for his life. Actually, I, I prefer Castlevania 1 over uh, Symphony of the Night. I prefer how simple it is. Really? Just in design, yeah. Th this is a damn good game. Even though I actually I've never just spawned Symphony. two red skeletons up top, you dumb <laughs> That's fucking annoying. game! <laughs> it's not perfect! I'm just saying, I, I wish there was more Castlevania games that weren't like, like Metroidvania games. Chris, you should- have you played Castlevania 3? Um, you and AVGN can go cry me a fucking river. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? AV Jen feels the same way. He he wishes that like there were more of the classics. <laughs> Cry you a river? What was that supposed to mean? Just, just wine. I wish there were more classic Castlevania games, but you know, honestly, um, that game they released that was in in cahoots with the new Bloodlines game. Yeah. It was simple, but it was nice seeing that kind of aesthetic again. And I did like it to a degree, but it was, like, insanely easy for a Castlevania game. Yeah. Like, I beat That's that with what I no trouble like. whatsoever. I like the challenge and the grind, and I like just the really simple design, and I, I like how super linear it is. It's called Super Nintendo Hard, or Sir Nintendo Hard. I tried playing Symphony of the Night, like, a few years ago, and I was just like... All, all these fucking rooms look too similar, I'm getting lost too easily. I played it a while ago, I didn't beat Chris. it, but I got like a good portion of the way through it. Yeah. I loved it a lot, but I yeah, I, I couldn't bring myself to finish it. I, I, don't, I don't mean to like go back to this, this old, this old bone, but... <laughs> honestly? Yeah. Nintendo Rhapsody, Chris. It's about being Nintendo hard. You're, you're right. He, he was, he was singing the tune that you want to sing. I love Nintendo. It is no mystery. Mega Man Mario! <laughs> Little Mac <laughs> and Nemo! Mama, I just lost the game. Mama, I just lost the game. Winks at camera to the audience. <laughs> You're a dick. <laughs> no! Oh, no, the crosses! Oh, oh fuck! Oh, Jesus! Oh, Dang, oh, you Christ. fucking... Alright, lol, I'm just gonna go right back. <laughs> 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 Uh, uh, throws a fucking Mexican jumping bean in your mouth, you deserve it. <laughs> you start jumping rapidly, you can barely <laughs> hold the controller. Settle down, Dave! Yeah, Dave, you fucking sick bastard. Oh, wow. you wasted that one. That was great, good job. Good job, you fuck. Let it out, Davey. <laughs> Shut your fucking mind. <laughs> Are we ever gonna stop saying that? No, cause Dave's name is David. It's funny. <laughs> it's You're perfect. Right. His name is David. It's perfect. <laughs> Watch out, Dave. One Dave, hand, you're fucked. Did you realize your name was gonna be oh, synonymous don't with? Don't get hit. Don't ah! get it! <laughs> what the fuck, man? <laughs> Did you know your name was gonna be synonymous with a? An Adam Sandler movie? Uh, it could have fooled me, man. <laughs> could have fooled fucking little old me. Well, Adam Sandler was out whenever you were born, so. Well, yeah. But also, so was so? Eight Crazy Nights. I don't fucking care. Dude, how old are you? <laughs> um. 24. I'm gonna be 25 in January. Aw, oh, you're so small, oh, so small, small little baby. so small, small, small. Looks, um, looks at name 30. tag. I'm 29. Oh, that's sad. I'm 29. <laughs> Good that's job, sad. you fucking Dilbert. <laughs> <laughs> I was so like, fuck you, Chris. <laughs> fuck you. Oh, damn. <laughs> no. Oh, this is hard. Yeah,
stuff. Someone make an AVG uh, editor, make an AVGN compilation of Dave going. Fuck! Dude, put the AVGN screaming in every frame right there. <laughs> yeah, every time Chris, Chris, every every time Dave press save and reload, put the AVGN going. <laughs> Fuck! And then saving and reloading. What was I gonna say? Ass, ass. Fuck! No! Ass. <laughs> Damn, man. Dude, this is hard. Yeah. I just want to say real quick, I have beaten all these games without using save states. And nobody believes you. I, and it's you're real. getting hacked right now. Yeah, no. you're, you're, you're actually losing, states. Ha getting hacked. Oh my god, dude. Editor, put in a clip of Mega64 hacking all the computers. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Love it. Dave. I think the problem is you keep getting ha hit by his sights. Dude, did might I might be on to something there. <laughs> did I ever tell you guys about the <laughs> Final Fantasy VII musical concert I went to? No. The one where they fucking played all the stock songs that everyone on Twitter bitched about? Yeah, no, I-, I the only reason I brought it up is because, uh, Rocco was there and he responded to my tweet. Oh, what did he- what happened? Basically, uh, we got scammed. It was me, Jaxie, Tomer, and Veronica, and we went to this Final Fantasy VII musical oh, that concert. Was good. Yeah. And we were all like, oh, I can't wait to fucking see if they do any new arrangements. Oh, I can't fucking wait. And we were getting so hyped yes. up. And uh, it was supposed to be like a big tribute to the music of Final Fantasy VII. That's how they promoted it on their website and with all the like uh, adverts on YouTube and shit. And they, yeah. they, they were showing clips of like the crazy motorbike and all this other shit. And I was like, I can't fucking wait to hear a fucking orchestral arrangement of crazy motorbike. And I was like freaking out. Oh, God. <laughs> damn. What did I- Ah, oh, this is goddamn NES- You can still load! Load! How- what- what glitch is this? It's yeah. I'm glad that it's a it straight froze. port. Yeah. It so froze because I was doing good! You <laughs> fuck <laughs> you! <laughs> but, you, you. <laughs> sorry. No, go ahead. I was like, I can't fucking wait to hear all these cool new arrangements. And then, like, we, we get all dressed up in, like, nice outfits. And we're waiting for the concert to start. And we're like surrounded by other people who are all talking to us, being like, "Can't wait to hear new arrangements, man! It's it's like this is gonna be the coolest fucking thing ever." And then the concert starts, and it starts with like the prelude, which is the first song in the soundtrack, right? Yeah, of and course. Then, and then they start with opening bombing theme, so we were like, "Oh my god, they're gonna go through every fucking song in the game!" Oh, we're like coming in our pants. And then they like the lights go dark, and the fucking composer walks off stage, and they start playing Mid Eye from the game. What? And we were just like. What the fuck? And they're like showing clips from the game on, on like on the big TV. Yeah. And like all these fat fucking idiot dorks are laughing in the crowd going, Oh, I remember that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and we were getting really fucking mad every time. That's fair. And then the fucking after like 15 minutes, this fucking composer walks back on stage and he bows and he walks back off stage. And then the piano guy starts playing a piano solo. And we're like, um, why is the fucking orchestra sitting there? in silence for this piano solo. And these are all arrangements we've heard before, like, of the fighting theme and shit that's, like, 15 years old now. Yeah. And we're- and, and I was just like, no, this is not- this is not it, no, all right? And then, he comes out, bows, uh, walks off stage again, plays more mid-eye from the game, shows more clips from the game on the big screen for 15 minutes. All these fat neck beard disgusting bastards are laughing and rubbing their big treasure trails, <laughs> laughing at all these little fucking clips from the game. They, they, they're being scammed and they're fucking loving it. <laughs> oh, 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 I remember that! Oh, right, and I'm just like, Chris, I'm getting- Their the brain doesn't work my, as fast as you. The vein in my head is like about to explode. I'm like, <laughs> I am being ripped off. This is fucking bullshit, People right? People in the crowd are really laughing? Everyone was fucking it, loving it. They're like, oh, my, I remember when Tifa had a bitch fight with the Scarlet. On the g oh. cannon. Yeah, and I'm just like, you fat fucking idiots. You're all being ripped off. And then, uh, so at the halfway point, I think about, hmm, let's say one quarter to a half of the show has been Mid-Eye Files. And I'm just like, w they're wasting an orchestra sitting there in the dark playing these Mid-Eye Files. And then, uh, I went to the manager oh. at, at the halftime point. You did it. Yeah. Went, I went yeah. to the, like, I, I went and I was just like, I want a refund. And they're just like, wait, what's wrong? I'm like, they're literally playing fucking How much music. are the tickets? Like, it was like hundred and fifty dollars. What? That's ridiculous! Yeah. I was like, I want a fucking refund. Uh, by the way, the company that did this, Wild Fairy, fucking avoid them, like the plague. They, they've done this kind of shit before and pissed people off in the past. Just look up all the shit they've done. 
Anyway, I was just like, I want a refund. They're like, uh, no, sorry, you can't have one. I'm like, great. So I went back in, sat down, and just, like, endured the rest of it. They played literally no new arrangements, and it was just mid from the game. What did, like, did Twitter have something to say about this? Yeah, you know, Twitter's freaking out the whole afternoon. No, here's the thing, right? I was just like, I went on Twitter, and I was expecting, like, people to be like, what the fuck? And literally no one was like, what the fuck? So I was like, I was like, what the fuck? Yeah. Why is this fucking all midnight? And then people were like, wait a minute, yeah, what yeah. the fuck? <laughs> and then people started complaining, and then Rocker responded, was like, oh yeah, I thought that was kind of weird too, and I was like, that's Rocker from Mega 64. <laughs> and I was like, god damn it. And then I was just like, I was just so fucking sad and disappointed. I was waiting for that concert for fucking months, like hyping it up in my head, just imagining all the cool things. And here's the fucking zinger. Fucking Nobuo Omatsu composed- <laughs> Dude, he, he arranged songs for orchestra himself for, for an album he did that were all new arrangements, like, right before this concert got organized. Yeah. They, he had all these new arrangements for, for Wait, a thing so called- why did they do that? Why didn't they, they just, play any of the songs from the new FF7 games? I've seen them in the too. demos, they're great. That too! So there's all these fucking new things they could have done, and they just went and, and they played shit from Distant World 1 and, like, one new song from Distant World 3, and it's just like, this is all shit I've heard a Chris, million times before. I was so fucking Chris, upset. I'm, I'm sorry. I mean, this isn't the same situation, but I kind of feel the same way with what happened to me when I purchased uh, <gasps> when I purchased Dragon Quest XI for PS4. Yeah, yeah, you told that me. That makes I, me so fucking I, mad. Yeah, I played that game. I got it for PS4. I was really excited. And when I found out that we were going to get the inferior MIDI version because the dude's just fucking racist to America. He just hates yeah, Americans. Yeah, that's what I heard, yeah. It's, it's like a running joke there, but it's not a very funny fucking joke. But, like, basically, I played all of Dragon Quest. I didn't beat it. Sadly, I literally got to the last boss of... Okay, so I beat the game, and I did the new game, like, the after game to, like, the last, last boss. Yeah. But I was so upset that I didn't play it. And now I see everyone, like, Dragon Quest XI is great. I love it on the Switch. The music's so good. And it kind of just, like... It kind of feels like I, I have a pit that's like I can't Ugh. fill that spot in my heart with that fucking game. Yeah. And so no matter what, I will not buy that game for Switch. And I will. if you Sorry. like it, <laughs> no, I, it's fine. If you like it, I'm glad. No, you know, I, I bought it on PS4. Do not it buy it on PS4, okay? Boycott the rest of the games on PS4. I, Get I, it for the Switch. I paid six dollars so, like, on you PS4. You haven't really explained it like fully. Basically, the guy who does the music, he's just he racist. composes amazing orchestras. Yeah, he's he's great. But he he makes damn well sure that there's only mid eye files for, for Americans because yeah, he doesn't yeah. like Americans. The only reason. Dragon Are you Quest, sure that's true? Yes, yes, the only he's reason- He's famous and he owns the rights to the song, so he sells them independently yeah. from the game to the American that's companies who can't block. afford them. Yeah, so hopefully, you know, he croaks and then some other person gets, like, a fucking hold of the copyright. But basically, like, the reason why Dragon Quest VIII had an orchestral con- like, an orchestral concert- I can't say this. Orchestral an, concert. Yeah. An orchestral concert piece mm. was by accident. Oh. Yeah, we, the Japan got the MIDI for yeah. that one, and because we got the expanded DQ8, we got, the, like, this- the orchestral. That's so yeah. fucking weird. And they even have the MIDI version for the one they put on Corey. 3DS. Even though it sounds good and it was fun, it's still inferior to the original orchestral. Yeah. yeah. Here's- here's my sob story. Yeah. <laughs> Dragon, right. Back, like, nobody was caring about Dragon Quest for years, so I petitioned to get seven on 3DS, and I waited four years for it to oh, come out yeah, after the yeah. Japanese version. Mm. And yeah. then when it finally came out, after I listened to like the orchestral soundtrack for fucking oh, years, oh, you yeah, for like a long ass time, like just signing these petitions and waiting. Uh, we got the game, and it was it was the midis, and, and it kind of ruined the game for me. Yeah. I, I played 40 hours of eight, it, but maybe too sad. I didn't I, finish I, Dragon Quest Seven. I played 820 hours in eight. And I stopped playing it. I oh got yeah! Really by far. the way, when eight they, also has the MIDI. I can imagine how frustrating that is because when Final Fantasy VII came out uh, back in '97, yeah. there was yeah. a PC port, and I and I really wanted the PC port for, for just just to say I have the PC port. Yeah. And when I played it, it had MIDI files on it because it couldn't fit uh, like WAV files on it at the time. Yeah. This was back in '98. But um, that like it must be so frustrating just knowing the only fucking reason is because the guy's racist. Yeah. No. It is, and and they joke about it, but you can see tons of people talk about it online. He just doesn't care. That's he, and you know why? Stupid. You know why? It's because the game doesn't do good. You wanna know why the fucking game doesn't do good? 
is because you release every other spin-off game. You don't release the main series. <laughs> Maybe that's why nobody fucking plays it. You twat. Dickhead, yeah. if you release the fucking games in America, <laughs> then people would fucking play it. Chris, are you allowed to ever be? Both. It's great. Uh, Bruh, it really pissed me off because Dave got I, I, Dave got me in a Dragon Quest. I played it. I enjoyed the fuck out of it. Oh, I just want to say, they and made I damn was... well sure that when they released 8 on the 3DS, the, all the orchestral music was gone. Yeah, and Bitify. And it's, it, but the orchestral 3DS version in Japan has the orchestra. Don't, don't say it. Oh my god. I just want to jump. Damn out. it! <laughs> I literally just want to slam my I'm head in a car door. Here. But guys, here, here's the... <laughs> uh, right, uh, right before this concert came out, Nobuo Matsu... He, he said, "Fuck you, Chris on the <laughs> No, he's awesome, dude. He's he's legit. He's, he's, he's old now. I think too. he's the only person that when they die, like that's a celebrity I look up to. I will actually cry. Like he, that's fair. He is everything I love about music. But anyway, fucking, he did this album called Bra Bra Brass, Final Fantasy VII, and yeah. it had all these amazing uh, arrangements that they could have used is for he that part concert. Of Black Mages. Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. Is he part of Black Mages? Yeah, the band. I think he's the keyboard guy. Because he plays piano. Mm. No, I bitch. But, dude, have you ever seen, um, the clip of them playing One Winged Angel? No, I've, no. Ne I've never seen, uh... It's really funny, because, uh, Nobuo Matsu's really cool and really, like... Like, well, at the time of recording this, he was having the fucking time of his life on keyboards. He was, like, doing all this, like, crazy, like... Bleh! He's, like, really expressive with his body language and dancing all over. And all yeah. the rest of the bandmates are just standing there stiff as a board. Like, oh, yeah. they're really good, but they literally just stand with, like, a stick up their ass. And they're like, mm, one winged angel. And he's like... <laughs> he's, like, dancing all over the stage and playing keyboards like a fucking psycho. I'll just be... I'll be really sad just because I know how much he shaped my love for music and exactly what I like in music is you... Pretty much due to him, so like yeah. that, that, that will be like a killer. Yeah. But hopefully he lives for another hundred years. Yeah, he That'd will. Be awesome. They're gonna discover aging, and he'll be the first one to get the serum. Oh my god! I, I, well, I'm just gonna. Fuck it, it is kind of fucked though. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want the clock. I need to go back. You this want the clock? Seeing you die over and over. <laughs> you want the clock? Yeah, I want the clock. Thanks, Corey. <laughs> <laughs> he recently stopped touring due to health issues, so that's bad. That's sad, man. That yeah. sucks. Yeah. That's not a good sign. It sucks. But may well, again, maybe they discover aging, or maybe they put his body into a robot, and he becomes the first android. There was one magfest where he was literally just hanging out with people, just be like, ah, and everyone's like, it's no boom, that's it. That's fucking awesome. He is like a fucking genius. Yeah. Oh, it's like a another musical genius is the guy who's done all the fucking Mario music. I don't yeah, know if Koji I ever Kondo. talked about Koji it. Kondo, yeah, yeah they're, they're like legends. They're they're like gifted. They're literally gifted. I don't yeah. know if I ever talked about it, but I I feel like Nobuo Matsu's super duper inspired by the Never Ending Story soundtrack. Mm. What? I'm not really? sure if I if I've seen it somewhere, but I was listening to the Never Ending Story soundtrack and I'm like, that sounds really like this song. And then it happened like three times in a row where I'm like, that sounds just like this song. The main theme of Never Ending Story is so catchy. I so, love it. I've never seen that movie. It just looks so ugly. I love to that me. fucking movie. The movie with Artorius, whatever the fuck yeah, his the, name the is. Yeah, the long dog. Artex. The long. <laughs> yeah. Oh. And Art Trey. I, uh, I saw the scene where the horse drowns because of Jeff. Yeah, Trey and Artex. What a name. <laughs> but there's, uh, there's a song in that. Movie called Atreus Quest, and it sounds just like oh, the Final oh. Fantasy VII theme, or not the final, the Final Fantasy theme. That yeah, it, it's like it sounds really similar. And then there's a there's a song in it called Bastion's Happy Flight, that sounds really like the High Wind Takes to the Skies at certain points. Mm. Oh really? Yeah. And then there was one other one. It'll come to me later. I love the Never Ending Story soundtrack though. It's really cool. Oh, you almost fucking tricked me again, you fucking game. <laughs> all right, now pause, all you nasty bastards. Suck my fucking dick. You have to say that, really. Yes. Really, bro. Honestly, a bit of a fail. Uh, every last one of these nasty bastards can just suck cock for life. <laughs> Get out of here. Is that like a punishment or something? I, don't, I just don't understand you sometimes. <laughs> Cock sucking is punishable against law. You're a homophobe. You would be I'm on not. YouTube uh, on homophobes.org. <laughs> yeah. I'm not. If you, if you looked up gay by last hour, it would be like Dave. Alright, ready guys? I guess tech. you're just sorting through your own insecurities when you Get say the secret. shit like that. Get the secret! Do you really want to do that? Uh, sure. No. Yeah! Well, dude, you're fucking safe! Your safe's coming every fucking other step! There's a secret? Okay, so wait, how, yeah. how do you do that again? That? You just did it. You just walk to the left? <laughs> <laughs> well, don't, don't worry about it, just try and fight uh, Dracula and get your butthole fucked. This oh, song's yeah. pretty awesome. 
That was the, the final f thing I think he got inspired by from the Neverending Story was the... The Swamps of Sadness drums that... <laughs> that's like the, the Turks theme. Oh yeah? Yeah. I mean, it, it's, it's really just one little part, but still. I had no idea his Dracula's coffin was right there. I thought that was like a booth That's his that book. He... He's reading Harry Potter. <laughs> I thought that was a booth that he talked to. I don't remember to do this fight, so this is gonna take a little while. Well, you need to hit the fireballs. First, you gotta stop sucking. Then, you gotta- yeah. There you go! You nice. jump over them, that's it. Woo! Fuck. You have to wait so they're aimed down, because if you jump up, and they'll go up. This is the most fucking epic fight I've ever seen. <laughs> My favorite part is that he has to do it again. Woo! Damn, Dave. Hey, good job. Oh! Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> In three, you can jump onto the stairs. Shit! Never ending story. I love that theme song. Oh, 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 oh. Turn around. Look what the what fuck is the never ending story? I know it's a movie, but like. It's about a book that never fucking goddamn well ends. Yeah, it always just resets. Yeah. Keeps adding pages on while you read it, and it turns into an infinite fucking buck that goes into outer space. What? That's a ridiculous story that never ends. And when the buck finally falls over, it splits the world in half. Dave, it just goes on and on, my friend. Somebody started reading it long ago, and that's how <laughs> the story goes. What are you talking about? It's the story that never ends. It goes on and on, my friend. Okay. Yeah. I remember that from the movie. <laughs> when Atreyu fucking drowns his horse and starts singing that into the camera. <laughs> and he's just like, This is a story that never ends! As Treyu's like drowning. Uh, editor, put put that song over Treyu sinking into the mud. That's fucking Artex. Whatever! Atreyu's the little boy! Put Atreyu's head over Artex. <laughs> just to make my point more valid. Artreyu. Yeah, make him Artreyx. <laughs> I want someone to remake the never-ending story, but with me as the main character. <laughs> uh, you're Treyo? Yeah. I always thought he reminded me of the boy from Jungle Book. He does look like Mowgli. Yeah. Well, how cool would it be to see like that Grand Wizard dude at the start be like, You're not Chris O'Neill! <laughs> like, um, I'm the only fucking Chris O'Neill I know. Yeah. So like, then you must be him! I'm a Treyu Mowgli, motherfucker. He's the black guy with the pointy head and he's got a big white beard. Gandalf? Uh, he's like, inverted Gandalf. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> I don't remember. There's a black guy, and he's- he looks so fucking cool. He's all like- Like all black guys do. You're all the Treyu of the guy- of the kids who hunt the big wildebeests. <laughs> and he's just like, um, kind of. Yeah, don't you wear on me. You moron. Dave, you're getting the jump down pretty good. Yeah, see, you need to be throwing the cross. I'm out of cross now. All right, well, now you need to see. You're at a cross. Him. Oh, that makes me cross. Fuck. I and you got freaking destroyed. So you should just throw the cross in the first half and just skip the fucking bullshit. All right, well, <laughs> you now you should just press reload. <laughs> I'm fucking glad we didn't play this game the regular way. Yeah, you would have farted in fucking the game with a crash. <laughs> I remember how bad the fucking NES was with like sound. Like your fucking sister comes clomping down her, with her big old fucking her big heels. Fucking club feet, yeah. Yeah, her clown feet knocks over the NES. It was every single time I play a game. Have you ever seen that lady who has elephantitis in her legs? And she just rolls down the stairs. She's got like elephant feet. She walks around town stomping on like ladybugs. Yeah, I feel sorry for her. That would suck. Have you seen the woman who has crab legs for feet? No, actually, no. I haven't. Does and that she's exist? got a crab's upper torso and a regular human head inside of the shell. Dave, you should be throwing that cross and then jumping twice and hitting. You can't ignore me forever. No, no, I, I heard you. I just have no <laughs> idea what the fuck you're talking about. <laughs> editor, please put big green stinky farts coming out of the coffin with fart sound effects. Yeah, also, Editor, there's a perfectly good blue screen that you need to be putting stuff behind there. Yeah, put farts yeah. coming out of there, too. Just put Corey's face looking into the room, buying the blue shit. Yeah. Yeah, let me try to peek and shake in. shake the screen, do Corey tapping on it and saying, <laughs> Do the fuck, who the fuck Corey, can I record you right now? Are you looking in there? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna bring up my phone. Go to my video. Okay, act like you're looking in a window. No, you gotta look at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Say, let me in. Yeah. <laughs> 
That's gonna be great. How's it look? You look like a freaking dork. Oh! Dave, the problem is that you're not winning. <laughs> <laughs> you started laughing almost before you even finished saying that. <laughs> You he suck. got you though. He like put you in your place. You actually just got fucking owned. You'll like, never sit fucking back. step foot out of your fucking cave again. Yeah, sit back and relax. Crawl back under that hole with all the spiders that fell Yeah, close your here. little trap door on top of you. Don't let it hit you on the head on the way out. <laughs> <laughs> Go fuck yourself. <laughs> Dave, you know you're doing pretty good. Dave, would you put your hand next to a trap door spider hole? Oh, Sat next to spider. Why would I ever do that ever. Editor, use the blue screen to show what a trapdoor spider does. Editor, you should be using the blue screen at all costs. Editor, please put a cool Windows 98 screensaver out there. <laughs> With the sound. <laughs> like you're booting into Windows 98. Show me the pipes. That's good. Now show me the maze with the cheese. <laughs> it's <Law>. fucking... <laughs> Holy uh, fuck. Editor, put a uh -oh. blood spray everywhere when his fucking head flew off. And make him say, aye. Alright, this sucks. What, what sucks? You have to do that all over again. Yeah, it's, this is hard. <laughs> Nobody ever said it'd be easy. I love you, Dave! Zippity Zoo Dot Zippity Day is a pretty damn good song. That is a fucking amazing Someone song. Someone should make a dubstep yeah. trap remix of that. I'm sure there actually already yeah, is. It probably, yeah, it probably exists. Okay. I think Skrillex has even done it. Or actually, I th that seems more like uh, something that uh, Mouse 5 would do, or whatever the fuck they're called. Have you seen the video of no, Skrillex no, no. closing his laptop and his dreadlocks are in the laptop so he rips <laughs> the top of his head off? <laughs> 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 He's got like a red skull poking out. <laughs> no, I didn't see that, but I feel like that would have been uh, tossed around. <laughs> like it would happen. When, when I was in high school, I went to Votech for computer repair, mm. and there was this dude in my class who like fucking loved Dead Mouse. That's yeah. how you say it, Corey. You said you said Mouse Five. <laughs> Um, <laughs> Dead Mal Five. I, I, that's what I would call. It. I would call it Dead Mal Five, and he would lose his fucking mind. I think he was like autistic or something. But like, yeah, no, it's Corey. You saying that totally reminded me. That. I'd be like, you like Dead Mal Five too? He's like, and, and that is not what it's called actually. It's called Dead Mouse. They, they have a dead mouth. He's got a big mouse on his head. Uh, stupid. It's definitely called Dead Mal Five. I don't know what anyone else is saying. Dude, I got a bunch of friends in Wexford who were fucking obsessed with Dead Mouse, and Why? one time uh, they, they just like him. And then one time he makes great video game references. I get <laughs> one, one time I made a, a musical oh, theory video, which was not very good. <laughs> I made a music theory video. Yeah, a musical theory video wasn't very good, and Dead Mouse fucking tweeted it at Paris Hilton. She was what? like, she was like, um, how do I like make music? And then he just like, he just forwarded her that video on his Twitter. That's awesome. And then all of my friends were just like, ah, that's fucking brilliant. And I was just like, okay. Who? Yeah, I was like, cool. who's Dead Mouse? Yeah. What I, the I fuck really... are you talking about, Corey? <laughs> You're the one who brought him up. No, I, that's uh, like, I'm just making a scenario of what Chris said. That musical theory video is actually quite bad. It doesn't make any fucking sense. Well, now Paris Hilton can use it for her remixes. Um, I don't think she's released a song since he fucking owned her by showing her my video. She made Oops I Farted Again. That was Did actually, she? yeah. She was the one who was singing that. I saw a very fucking demeaning video of her being plowed by some poor unfortunate soul. This is the one where he's like, why in that pussy bitch? When he's like fucking her. In like the dark room. He said, inflate your pussy <laughs> like a bubble. And then he pops it with a pencil. He's like, we need to bring down this w window because your post is thang. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? It's an opening line to a Bloodhound gang. He's like, we need to open up this window because your post is thang. <laughs> He's like, my, my friend Jerry Grant who gets, gets me in home at class. Uh, I'm going to be really cheap now. Check this out. <laughs> We're going to really save some of our way through this. Uh -oh. oh, you fucking, oh, you fucking maniac. That's actually, you know what? I don't actually care. I don't think the viewers care either. Who fucking cares? Dave, do it like, yeah, now save. <laughs> now save. Save when you Now beat. save! Oh my god, Dave, you're okay. fucking... What is this? Is, is this the run? Is this the one hit run that you're gonna s submit to GDCQ? <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. shit. Game's done super quick. Oh, you got I hit, forget the... Oh wow, you might as well reload. Uh oh. He turns into a big drumbo. If it's any, if it's any consolation, this part's even harder. Actually, this part has a really- uh, has a rhythm that once you get used to it, it's actually not that hard. What were they thinking? This is a series of murdering crows going around murdering everybody! <laughs> That's a Game Dude's reference, I think. What the heck? I, I got hit once. Yeah, the yeah, conquer he's like, must be conquered! Yeah, I concur. And I concur that conquer will be conquered.
I used to unironically watch and enjoy him back in the day. His theme song is great. <laughs> fucking, what was I gonna say? Plays the games with, at least he had a theme song, unlike fucking Irie Gamer, who's like, da na 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 Perfect. I, okay, I want someone to make a compilation of Doug pulling out his gun just and then just have tons of videos of people getting shot by guns And he's just every one of them. It's like the the sting of him starting his song <laughs> I want that so bad I want somebody to cut out him taking out his gun and shooting it and I'm put it on it like a generic green screen So people can take <laughs> him shooting things and make that into a meme. Yes, oh, I'm sure e somebody ever, has since, that. ever since I saw that Hannibal Burra meme or whatever. What's Hannibal his name? Burris. Yeah, Hannibal Burris like getting unloaded by a gun after Nostalgia Critic pulled his gun out. <laughs> this is the funniest goddamn thing I've ever seen in my life Life. It makes me laugh every single time. Pretty sick. It was pretty. Yeah, editor, put that meme on if it exists. How do you get past that? I don't like memes, but that meme makes me lol. That memes make me lol too. That makes me lol. The meme is that funny. That memes makes me rub belly. It is funny meme lol. Corey, you ever laugh so hard that like little water squirts out of your belly button? <laughs> uh, no. Why'd you look down when you say that? Actually, I have a little bit of sog down there. <laughs> You might just ever, be sweat. Have you guys ever shit so hard your back cracks? <laughs> no. That uh, happens to me a lot. Really? <laughs> yeah. I've I, shit so I, hard I'm... my fucking ears pop. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> uh, 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 I love learning more about you guys. I fucking, <laughs> no dude, We're I shit so hard friends. my entire fucking back cracks from top to bottom. It's crazy. <laughs> From top to bottom, Chris! <laughs> Your whole fucking back from top to bottom! Yes. Holy fuck! That can't be right, man! I'm a very cracky man. You can't man. hit him in his dick, I can you crack have to most bones head. in my body, and I could even crack my penis. But yeah. I can't do it no more. Can you crack your penis and make the blood rush faster? No, it doesn't work no more. I, I'm afraid that if I try it, I'll hurt my penis. Uh, yeah, you, you have a broken cock. This is my eyelid. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking That's imagine? That's so scary the way you just did that. <laughs> you did it instantly. Holy fuck. I told you. This is my lower Are you key. trying to save with all full health? Yeah. yeah. You are a fucking scum saving supreme, dude. Uh, I wanna move- I wanna play other castle games Do you want some fucking extra tonight. curly fries with that? Alright, save. Mmm. Cory. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Hold your testicle, twist it one degree to the right. Oh, you're doing that. Oh, I thought you wanted me to do that. Um, I bet my cock smells really bad right now. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> what was the point of saying that? Why would you say there, that? There is no point. Mental image, just to distract Dave. Puts Mexican jumping bean up your pee hole. Why do you have so many fucking Mexican jumping beans, Chris? Where'd you get your back? So I can flick it and this happens. Stop it. I hate that noise. I actually might have just killed this run by- Did you accident. fucking save? Yeah. Dave, you oh, massive oh, fucking flounder. you fucking flounder. income poop. You were actually a tar nozzle. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Dave, save! What, what right now? Well, you already saved! Oh, uh, yeah, you're right. Dave, you are a lemon-scented tar nozzle. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, get freaking destroyed, right, dude. This, this is what Saves right. Coming was made for. <laughs> <laughs> this is how TA, TASs work, by the way. Oh, this is what, this you what gotta it is. You got to run under him next time. Oh, 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 fuck, you might have actually fucked everything up. Dang! You can't run under him. You can at all? Nah, that doesn't work. I think you can. I think you just got to time it really good. Get close. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> dude. Just keep trying to run under him. Just keep trying, oh! dude. Oh! Go, jump, run under him the second he jumps. You can see his foot lift up. Go! Yeah. Oh, no, oh, no. you can't, you, you can't. Can. Yeah. Just try it, just try it. There's gotta be a way. There's no way they'd fuck you like that, is there? There's no way. Just try it. Just try it. Just... Uh, I feel like you, you could've made stopped. it. You stopped! I, I didn't. It's, I stopped when the hitbox touched me. Try oh. it. Oh. I don't know how close I can get. <laughs> Alright, hold on. He's gonna hit you when he goes diagonally up. What?! <laughs> That's bullshit! Ah! Corey, give this to me, give this to me! Corey, Wait, give, Corey. Give, it to me. Give, it, give it to me. Okay. Okay. 
You said it. He jumped extra high that uh, time. Oh, well, that's because I was so close to the sprite that I actually know that you can sequence break it, Dave. Why do you think I took the controller? A little known fact, I knew exactly what I was doing. That's freaking sweet. Well, right, looks we like the day is saved right, thanks there, to game's, me. Game's over. We, yeah. All right, well. All right, you, you did save the day with that one. You did pretty much save everything. That's Castlevania 1, everybody. Hey! Editor, take out every single edit ever. We beat it on our first yeah! try. Yeah, editor, make it seamless. No, don't do that, actually. It's funnier when you have the lows. Yeah, no, we're dirty, filthy cheaters. And Put that so? castle on the ground. Every, um, every what time the I fuck see is that, that, I want to hear. That's like, what you get on the NES for when you know you beat the game and shit. Every time I hear it's that, I, I want to hear the ending, the opening to like the Mega Sign. The da na 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 na. Every time I see the castle. By Trans Fisher. What Fred the heck? Fox. <laughs> James Banana. What, what the, the heck? heck? Um, I'm getting so peeved. Christopher I have steam. B. What the heck? Did they make all these names parodies of classic names? Frankenstein! That makes me fucking squirt! <laughs>